Spine curls is a great mobility exercise for your back, especially the middle section of the back where the attachment of the rib cage can often make it fairly stiff. So come down onto your mat, bend the knees, feet flat on the floor, and I want you to place the small ball between the knees. The small ball is great for maintaining alignment in exercises like this. Then relax the head, neck and shoulders. Make sure you can just turn the head side to side so there's no tension in the upper body and the hands relax down by your side. We're going to inhale to prepare. And then as you exhale, draw your belly button in, tilt your pelvis towards you and you're peeling your back up away from the mat, one vertebrae at a time. Then breathe in, reach the arms away and take them up and overhead. Exhaling and peel your back down, one vertebrae at a time. Then when you're all the way down and the lower back is completely released and relaxed, bring your arms down by your side. If you're very tight in the lower back, you can keep the arms at your side. So you're going to breathe in, exhale, pull in your navel and peel your spine up. And then you can inhale and then exhale and peel your back down again. You can try a combination of both, one with the arms going up, one with the arms at your side and see which one feels better. <coughs> so we're breathing in, exhale, tilt your pelvis so you're sinking the lower back down into the mat. This is probably the most important part of this move is to actually drop the pelvis in and then you peel up. Once the spine starts leaving the mat, it doesn't take very long. Then reach the arms up, drop your chin forward here. So as you peel down, you're trying to lengthen through the back of the neck and peel the back down. Release and relax the lower back and then bring the arms down. If you feel it in your buttock muscles or the backs of your legs, chances are you have the legs too far away from you and you need to bring them in a tiny bit more. We're going to do two more spine curls. So you're breathing in. Exhale, pull the navel in, sink the lower back, tilt the pelvis here right at the beginning and then peel your spine up all the way up onto your shoulder blades. But you're not squeezing your glutes and losing neutral at the top either. You're keeping your body in a nice ski slope position. Breathe in, reach the arms up and overhead. Exhale and try and imprint your spine. So keep tilting the hip bones towards you as you peel your back down. Release and relax the lower back and then the arms come down. Let's do one more. So you breathe in. Exhale, pull the navel in, peel your back up. Stop in that ski slope. Now slide your shoulders away from your ears and then bring the arms up and overhead. Drop the chin slightly forward so you're lengthening through the back of the neck, feeling each segment of the spine peeling down. Relax the lower back, relax the buttock muscles and then bring the arms back down by your side. Let's take the small ball out from between the knees, pull into the back of the thigh, and bring yourself up to sitting to finish.